20 game winners, and I know, right? Uh, raise your hand if you thought that is what the final box score would look like. No. Yeah, exactly. Nice try. No. Nine o'clock in the East on your Saturday morning. Randy Scott, Jade McCarthy with you for a fresh hour of Sports Center. Yeah, you probably expected a one run game, sure, just not a 10 to 9 no. one run game. Exactly. You probably expected the best pitcher on the planet to be just fine with six runs of support. Uh, but these baseball playoffs continue to keep us guessing. Let's take you out to Chavez Ravine yesterday. Slade, Herm Edwards, he knows exactly what I'm talking about. All right, so of the two unbeatens going into the weekend, who comes out that way, Coach? The Miami Dolphins right now are popping the bottles of champagne. Tough on Monday night, so we will see how they come off of that game. As you said, this is a game that they need to win. All right, another Ohio team has a quarterback who plans to reach out to Jameis Winston. Johnny Manziel says he wants to help Florida State's quarterback. The Heisman, according to Manziel, brings, quote, a lot of responsibility, a lot of scrutiny. It's a lot of weight on your shoulders. But that's part of what comes with winning the trophy. Uh, what do you think of all this? Good for Johnny because he's reaching out to a guy that uh, is wearing his shoes. And next weekend so let's go Danny Cannell with us after a wild Saturday uh, two words probably to define it changing landscape because you have number two Oregon who lost on Thursday number three Alabama number four Oklahoma number six Texas A&M and number eight UCLA they all lost mayhem. yesterday mayhem. complete mayhem <laughs> right so Kirk Herbstreet, he has Auburn, FSU. We just finished week six. There's yeah. a lot of football left to play. There is definitely a lot of football left to play, no doubt about it. But it's kind of fun to try to figure out all those projections in this new landscape in the college football playoff era. Danny Canal with us on SportsCenter.